Hey everybody, it's Aiden here once again and welcome back to some Assetto Corsa as we're going for a Sunday drive around the Isle of Man TT circuit. Now if you don't know a lot about the Isle of Man TT, it's where a bunch of motorbikists go to try and kill themselves. Uh, they think it's because they've got massive balls, but really it's because they are absolutely insane. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a Lotus Evora, this car right here, and uh, yeah, we're just going to go for a little bit of a cruise around the TT circuit, see what it's like uh, from the perspective of a sane person, i.e. A, a car driver. So let's hop on a plane, get to the Isle of Man, and uh, go for a drive. They say that no man is an island, but what about the Isle of Man, eh? No? Alright, let's just go for a drive. Welcome to the Isle of Man. I wish the sat nav worked, because I don't know where I'm going, but uh, let's just go for a simple Sunday drive. Hopefully we won't need that ambulance there. The heel and towing into this double mini roundabout. The worst kinds of mini roundabout. Really don't know where I'm going around here. There we go, we're through. Tricky part. Very bright here. We come into another village. This might be a port of the Grand Prix Legends version of the track. Hence the brightness. As for frame rates, I'm getting 150 frames a second here, so... It's not that much of a drain. Well, considering we've got the Nürburgring, Circuit de la Sarthe and all these other tracks in the game. Can we get some air? A little bit. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going. I like how they just put sandbags in front of that telephone box there. Now I have actually got an uncle that lives on the Isle of Man. And I wonder what it was that first attracted him to that tax haven. miles an hour, so we're absolutely annihilating the speed limit. So we get it into this corner. That wasn't so bad. Lotus Evora, quite nimble. I probably couldn't have picked a better car to do this drive in. Hello. Dear. A tight right hander. There we go. Got it. Something hill. I didn't. I was going too fast. I couldn't read the sign. But it's de-restricted up here. No speed limits. Outside of the villages on the Isle of Man. And the bikers are probably going much quicker than me. Uh, I think that's because they are certified insane. Rallying that brave. This is insanity. Probably could have gotten through there quicker, but coming 
after another village now. Stop off a petrol there. Front splitter clanging off the, the ground. Let's get full throttle for a bit. Oops. Yeah, we just made it through that. Got out of fourth gear yet. It's like driving back in Lincolnshire. There we go, fifth gear. Where's the next bend? Oh, it's here. <laughs> this is how little I know. Whoa, that was a bit of a lag spike. Just kept it on the road. Line to my right. Now I recognise this bit from the telly. I mean, Ramsey. I think this is where my uncle lives. This is Bray Hill. Okay, now the track's starting to get interesting. As we almost understeer into a whatever that is. Sup. Okay, we'll pretend that that never happened. Gooseback. I think that's what that said. We're climbing up now over the top of the mountains. Where, where am I going? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're coming back down over the other side of the island now, aren't we? I would not want to crash off the side of this. Welcome to the Isle of Man. 
I'm already on the Isle of Man. They say no man is an island, but what about the Isle of Man? several segments for Top Gear across here. Now, could this be attempted in a Formula One car? That is the question. Hello! Again. Crenshaw, did that say? And for my Continental viewers, there you go. I'm just going to put it back on the correct side of the road. <laughs> Crunk my splitter off the ground again. to work this must be. Across a mini roundabout again. Oh, is this the end? And there we go. That's a lap of the Isle of Man. We made it. We only crashed once. Which is uh, a new world record for me. I'm going to park up here because I think there's a pub nearby. Can we park up at the pub? Yeah, here's the pub. So, Thank you very much for watching, and uh, I've been Aidan Millward, and if you want to see more like this, remember to subscribe so you can be the first to be notified of future content. Have a great day wherever you live in the world, and I'll see you again very, very soon. So until then, goodbye.